Hey, what's happening, good one? I am Sir James from GamerFusion.com, and today I was sent a code for this game right here, Battleship, to review. So I figured, you know what, let's go ahead and play some Battleship. One of my favorite board games, so I'm looking forward to checking out the video game version of it. And uh, hopefully it turns out well. Let's go ahead and kind of load up here. There's uh, leaderboards and all that fun stuff, because there is online play. Of course, we have the automatic saving, yada, yada, yada. And let's go ahead and begin. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just quickly look around the settings here. So here is the play option. So once we get in here, we have two options between local play and of course online. Now, if we're not gonna be facing any human players, we're gonna be facing against the AI. So we're gonna go ahead and go to local play. You have a tutorial section because there is an additional game mode. You also have a campaign a player versus AI, which is what we're going to be doing, and a player versus player, however, I don't know how this will quite work out, but anyways, here we go. There's two modes here, I don't know how to play this one, this one's called Clash at Sea, but we're going to go ahead and choose Classic, because, I mean, it's classic, you gotta start with that one. But this one is, uh, play the game with Class, Clash at Sea, rule each player spends resources to activate ship's abilities, which I think is pretty cool, but we'll, right now we're just going to do Classic. We have a few different options. We have the military, the orc, the tech. There's also the pirate, which I want to get, so I'm probably going to figure it out after this. So we're going to go ahead and select the military. And there's also skins for your crafts as well. Let's go ahead and select a medium to just begin with. It's been a while since I played Battleship, but I mean, the concept is quite simple. All right, so right now we have to figure out where we are gonna be putting our crafts at. So let's see, we're gonna put this one, our carrier over here, our battleship right here, patrol boat, and we'll put right here on the corner of the destroyer. I guess we'll put towards this area. And then our submarine, we'll put over here. Yeah, I think we're good with that. All right, so right now it's going to pick who's gonna go first. Wait a minute, that guy has the pirate ship. Looks like I get to go first. I have 30 seconds to make a decision. What's cool about this is that if you press R1, you can figure out where your fleet is at. Or if you do the other method, you could do the classic, you know, A1, so to speak. So let's see, we're gonna go ahead and pick C7. And it's a miss. Oh, you got a miss, okay. Let's go ahead and select C4. Highly explosive. No, that don't work. Ooh, you gotta miss. Okay, so let's go ahead and pick E2. Nope, another miss. You know, one thing I gotta keep in mind is that, uh oh. Ooh, he got a hit, and that was my largest ship too. That's not good. Is that this game actually runs better than the risk game? Uh oh, that's another hit. Let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, choose here. Another miss. Uh, he just missed. Come on, let me hit something. Oh, yes, I hit something. <laughs> oh, that's another hit. But he has one here. I just need to figure out the direction. Alright, hit number two. My carrier is only going to last one more turn. I got his. 
No, my carrier's still alive. Just barely. This has got to be a carrier or something. No, I sunk his battleship. <laughs> That's the name of the game. Okay, he just missed. Alright, so let's figure out where his other ships are. No, this. Alright, there goes my carrier. You will be missed. Oh, I got another hit. Yes. That's a miss. Let's see what direction this is going. Okay, it's definitely not that way. Ooh, almost. Yeah, that's a miss. Uh oh. You found my boat. Alright, I think I found... No, that's not his boat. This would be his submarine, I think. Nope, the destroyer. Okay. Alright, there goes my patrol boat. All right, so far, it's, it's a tie, two and two. Another miss. Uh oh, that's a hit. Let's see. This is where things get harder. That one is getting off lucky. That's another hit. Oh yes, found one. <laughs> Oh, he just missed again. Alright, so we need to figure out the direction of this one. It's not that way. Uh oh. One more hit. You sunk my battleship. Alright. That, that boat's gonna be hard. Getting closer to the one. Let's see, I think that's a miss. Yep, that's a miss. If I could find that patrol boat. Uh oh. That's not cool. Oh, 
pretty hit. Off another hit. Here's that damn boat. Let's try right here. Still nothing. Ooh. It's not looking too good. No, he sunk my destroyer. Or Severine. Yep, Severine. Oh, I found one. I hope this is the boat. It could be the carrier. Yeah, it's the carrier. Uh oh. He found my last ship. It's not looking too good. Got his carrier. This could be it. Yep, yeah, it's game over. I lost. Ah, oh, that was a close game. I, if I only found that small one, that would have been perfect. But the little small ship is hard. If you can find that right off the bat, you're good to go. So anyways, that was a game of uh, Battleship Classic Mode. Uh, overall, I think this is a pretty cool game, and uh, I, I, honestly, I think this is better than the Risk version, but that's just me. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys next time.